In today's video, we're going to be having a look at another box from the folks over at Z-Box. Z-Box is the mystery box made for geeks, and another box has arrived. Unfortunately, again, it looks like it's been trampled over by a moose, but I think the contents are going to be still just fine. If you guys are uh, certainly enjoy the contents of this unboxing and think to yourself, I would like to subscribe to Z-Box right at this minute. I don't even want to let another day go by. I'll put the link down below. You guys can subscribe to Z-Box. But nonetheless, this is the Z-Box for this month. We're going to get this opened up. I'm going to use a knife. And I think we're going to use Old Red for this one. And there is a seal right there. You see it? It's right there. It's right there. I'm going to go ahead and cut that. And now that that's been cut, we can open up and inspect the contents. To be fair, I think the problem is that the box is so big, because generally they always have a lot of stuff inside, that if there is maybe a smaller amount of stuff, the box does get a little concaved over just neglect of the courier, who's just whipping stuff around, especially during the holiday season. You know, it's sometimes the worst. But it looks like everything arrived safe and sound. Let's have a look at what we got inside. The first thing we got inside is a t-shirt. And the t-shirt is a V for Vendetta. You got Freedom Forever, V for Vendetta. It says, hey, age 17 and up. Uh, let's just check the size, make sure the size is, well, actually it doesn't give you a size in there, unless it's on the back or maybe on a tag. But we got a V for Vendetta t-shirt. Put that over to the side. I know, I know, I didn't fold that the greatest. Next we have, oh, look at this. A Loki Master of Mischief card, or uh, magnet, I should say. Oh, I like that. That looks very, very like vintage, vintage sort of, um, you know, the silver age of comics, so to speak. Oh, I like that. I, I'm a, you know what, I'm a sucker when it comes to magnets. You could give me magnets like, Every single subscription box, they always try, I do try, to try to put those on my fridge. I know the fridge looks like it's, well, if you haven't seen my fridge, because I've done a video on my fridge, it would seem a little strange to do so. The fridge is just adorned in magnets. Moving along, we've got ourselves a Purge Z-Box exclusive pin. Like that, on the back. Comes to us from the Hut Group. And it's a Z-Box exclusive. I can add that to my pin collection, which is growing as much as my magnet collection is growing. I can add that to my mag my pins. I see an action figure in here. Oh, nice. We got ourselves the DC Multiverse. This is the Suicide Squad Deadshot. I've already actually reviewed this one. Now, this one comes also with the arm for the Collect and Connect Croc. There's the back of it right there. A total of six figures were included in this set. I think actually that's not true. There's a couple of, there were variations. There was a variation Joker and Harley Quinn. Very cool. I'm actually trying to remember. I'm putting my finger up to my virtual face. What did I do with my dead shot? I can't even remember now. At least I got another one here. Uh, the next thing we have is Hellboy from Cult Vinyl. Figure number two, and if, yeah, we did get Dread already. I'm trying to remember which box that was. Got the Hellboy now for this release. And because it's using basically the same sort of shape, it's hard to determine what that other figure is. That would be figure three, though, but I don't know what that figure would be. Really neat looking Hellboy, though. New Hellboy reboot around on the horizon starring the sheriff from Stranger Things. I'm kind of a little disappointed, I have to admit, that Ron Perlman isn't coming back. I don't think he's really at the, he's too old to play the role sort of point in his life. I think he could have still come back, so I'm curious to know why they recast him. Uh, the next thing we have is a card image of Flash Gordon. It's not Flash Gordon, actually. It's, I uh, can't remember his name. Hmm. Kang? Is it Kang? Is it is it Kang? I don't know. Somebody can tell me down below. And then once that one person tells me, another 15 people will tell me the same thing. That's okay. Flash Gordon. Uh, I have to admit, though, not one of my favorite movies. I watched Flash Gordon once. I watched Flash Gordon a second time. I didn't make it through the second time. I, didn't, I did not enjoy it. That's, by the way, all the rest of the contents of the Z-Box. 
This month is entitled Chaos. And actually, it's the October box, to be more exact. The October 2017 box, Z-Box, entitled Chaos. Let's have a look through the magazine here. Chaos isn't a pit. Chaos is a ladder. And that's a little finger there. That's, um, I don't remember what his real name. I, well, I don't know his name in the... Um, Lord... Is it Lord Tareth? Lord... I don't know. Somebody will tell me. <laughs> Somebody will tell me. Uh, let's have a look through here. Life at the end of the world. Again, all po apocalyptic related. Mad Max, you've got Rick Grimes. Uh, Guillermo del Toro. There's there's Ron Perlman. New Pacific Rim around the horizon. Or on the horizon. i got to admit, I'm not looking forward to the new uh, Pacific Rim. It doesn't feel like it's got that same... Anybody know what I'm talking about? It's got that. It doesn't have that same vibe. It doesn't have the same vibe that the uh, the first one seemed to have had. Here's the contents. We had a V for Vendetta T-shirt, a Hellboy cult vinyl, Anarchy Purge pin, Ming Ming. It wasn't Kang. It was Ming Ming the Merciless print, Loki magnet, and one of three different uh, DC Comics multiverse Suicide Squad figures, which actually says or or or. But then uh, Deadshot also, well, he's not on the list, but that's the one I got. Uh, let's see here. Ladder of Chaos. Did I actually say his name here? Hmm. Just looking, just looking. No, no. Lord, I think it's Lord Baelish. Is it Lord Baelish? I'm trying to see if it's if it says anywhere on here. Yeah, right there. Baelish. Baelish manipulates several members of the Stark family. Or Baelish. Aha, see? Memory eventually comes back. Sometimes it just takes a little longer. A section on Flash Gordon. Not one of my favorite movies. Chaos in Temple of... Uh, inside the Temple of Chaos. That looks like NES. Looks like an NES cartridge. What was the name of that one? Oh, Final, Fan Final Fantasy. Everybody laughs and scoffs this guy, but, you know, it'll happen to you as well when you get old. There's also Joker versus V. Uh, well, morality, clearly Joker's got nothing. V wins for that one. Fear factor and destructiveness, Joker wins for both. I'm, I'm willing to think Joker would have won this one versus V. Uh, next month, by the way, is Classics. And there's like a kind of a little nod to Jurassic Park. So I'm thinking that might have something to do something to do with the November box, which is also a good indicator to you as well. If you're still a little on the fence, I don't know, this month's box, mm, I'm, not, I'm not sure the chaos end of it, but gosh darn it, man, Jurassic Park, I'm on board that. Uh, you can click the link down below and subscribe to Z-Box. In the meantime, though, Z-Box for the October box was entitled Chaos. And I guess for the most part, yeah, Chaos, okay, Hellboy, eh, questionable. But for the most part, entitled Chaos. Chaos stuff. Inside. Chaos. Speaking of videos. Well, did I say speaking of videos? Okay, speaking of videos. Let's just throw that in now. Speaking of videos, if you haven't had a chance to subscribe to this channel and want to see more videos like this, there, that's how we can connect the two. Uh, make sure you hit that little subscribe button down below. If you also want to check out some previous month's boxes for Z-Box specifically, I've got a playlist for Z-Box as well. I don't know why I'm fanning. I'm cooling off Hellboy. It's okay, man. It's okay. If you guys have again uh, haven't had a chance to subscribe, make sure you hit that little subscribe button. More videos are heading your way. More unboxings are also heading your way as we have a look at other monthly subscription box systems as well. Monthly subscription boxes. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.